internet land. Uh, it's going to be a three-part video, but I'm going to try to make it as short and sweet as possible. On a road trip, Sunday morning, y'all know bloody where. But, anyway, point is, listen to some music. Listen to this uh, old band from the late 80s, early 90s called Nelson. Some of you are going to be old enough to remember this. Some of you are not. However, Nelson, awesome band. Never got enough credit, in my opinion. Wrote a great song that had three lines, one at the end of each verse, that are words to live by. And the great thing about a lot of music is, is it's subjective. Uh, you know, they, they could be singing about a lost love or a girl or but it can mean something different to you, to me and not all music's like that, but a lot this is one in particular that is that way but who would have thought Nelson has like some of the greatest life advice ever to give so I want you to YouTube the song After the Rain by Nelson. I want you to listen to it, especially those last couple lines in all three verses. Things will never change until you want them to. That is so damn powerful. That's the first one. Actually, maybe the second. I can't remember which order they are in. But, anyway, yeah. to uh, finally face the truth. That's one in there, too. So, I mean, yeah, he could be struggling in life with whatever. You know, you're not happy with your job. You're not happy with uh, or your lack of job. <laughs> you're in a bad relationship. Uh, you're looking for a relationship. I, uh, whatever it is, Things will never change until you want them to. So make change, inspire change, be change, do it. Now that being said, Nelson After the Rain. That's your homework. Google it, YouTube it, I mean, play it, listen to it. Number two, just stop at a little chain uh, fast food joint to get some breakfast never that great, but you know, it's quick, easy. Chains, or, or what, is, what, what, what else do they call them? Uh, they call them something. Uh, franchises. They've taken over. And I don't like it. It's it stripped the identity of the regions away, you know. You go to Florida, to Tennessee, to Pennsylvania, to Nebraska, and everything looks the same anymore because it's all the same McDonald's, Walmart's, Hardee's, Exxon's, and whatever. You know, used to, when you went to a different place, it looked different, it felt different, things were different. And now, all those identities are just gone. Or, or they're dwindling. I mean, they're still a little. They're dwindling. You know, it's... I don't know. I think that's sad. So, here's your second homework. Song number two. John Anderson. Look Away. Look Away by John Anderson. YouTube that. I don't... To me, that's one of them songs you just cannot take any other way than the way the artist meant to. And so much truth and power in that song as well. So homework number one, Nelson after the rain. Homework number two, John Anderson look away. Now for the third and final homework of the day from your captain, oh captain, my captain, speaking, find you a song. Today, it's 
Sunday morning, find you a song that hits you in the heart outside of those two. That hits you in the heart, makes you feel something, makes you feel good, happy, alive, makes you feel good about being you. Find that song, because that, when you feel it, that is rock and roll. Rock and roll is not just a way of life. Rock and roll is part of the human soul. And it doesn't have to be fast-paced electric guitars to be rock and roll. It doesn't. If you feel it, if it makes you feel good, if it creates any kind of emotion at all, I don't care if it's Willie Nelson or Enya or Beck or Guns N' Roses. Five Finger Death Punch, uh, Celine Dion. I don't care if you relate to it. it makes you feel good. There's rock and roll in it. I promise. You. I promise. You. Like I said, not just the way of life. It's part of the human soul. It really is. So find something that, like I said, makes you feel alive. Makes you feel good about being you. Makes you happy. Makes you feel inspired to get up and do something. Maybe inspired to make some change. That's the first song I tell you. So, find your own personal song. Play it. It's Sunday morning. Hey, maybe, maybe you're going to go to church. I fly away, fly away, oh glory. I fly away in the morning. I'll tell you right now, that one pumps me up too. It can be gospel. It doesn't matter. That's a great thing. Find something that makes you want to move your body. Tap your foot, stomp your foot, play the play the lap drums, air guitar. Maybe just sway your hands. Maybe throw them up in the air. It doesn't matter. Anything that creates motion, motion creates emotion. When you find a song that gives you motion and creates emotion, then you have found the heart of rock and roll, my friend. So do that. Third homework assignment. Find you something that's spiritually just you. Own it. Get out there. Have a great Sunday. All right. Um, that's all. That's how I was going to keep it short. So, bye-bye. Um, it's Captain Dino L. Time for the blooper reel. Thank you. 